Welcome back. Today we'll be playing The Sims 4. It's a new playthrough for this channel. I'm very excited. It's one of my favorite games. Let's get started. So I already randomized until I found like a base that I sort of liked. I want to go for like cute magical girl vibes like Sailor Moon or like magical do re mi uh etc etc something cute uh that's why <laughs> i already made her eyes pink uh i haven't done anything else except take her hair off because i didn't like the one that was on i don't know if i want to make like a single sim or a family yet we'll see <laughs> depending on how long i spend on her i know this is a monster high hair but like it's the vibe. It's the right vibe. I'm gonna take it off and come back to hair after we finish, after we perfect the facial features. I have so many mods installed on this. It's a lot. <laughs> if you see any mod that you specifically kind of like, if it's like something small like the eye color, I'm not gonna be able to find it. But if it's like the background of the creative sim, maybe I can find that for you. And let me know and then I'll try to link it. Or like the command center mod. I don't remember what it was called, like MCC command center or something. When I think, when I say MCC, I think of the Minecraft championship. I'm always trying to go out of the box when I make sims, like my specific box because when I make sims, they all look the same. <laughs> it's, I have, I have a style and I wanna get out of it because like, obviously I like it, but I wanna be more creative. So the thing is when I'm making a sim, I will get used to how a certain feature looks on their face. And then after a while, when I'm trying to change it, it just no longer looks like how I'm used to it. And my brain is like, no, I don't like any of these, but actually it's just because my brain just doesn't like change. Definitely want her hair to be pink, I think, but which one? Because like most of them can be pink. Some of the uh, custom content ones aren't going to have a pink option, but like most of them will. See the skin overlays will change how their face and the body looks. I think we'll go with this one. She's already so cute. I love her. I was gonna say I don't think I have very many magical girl things, but this is a very magical girl. I kind of just always go for the same outfits over and over. That's because they're cute. Okay, what kind of shoes? The cat one, obviously. In my opinion, the worst part of The Sims 4 is not being able to copy the makeup from outfit to outfit. She's so cute. I wish that The Sims 4, or The Sims in general, would allow you to have disabilities with your Sims. The same with other games, like, why can't my character just be in a wheelchair? Like, it's something that obviously a lot of people deal with, so like, why can't my sim use crutches or a cane or be in a wheelchair? It takes me so long to pick eyeliner only to end up using the same ones every single time. She's so cute. I love her. In most of the face paint category, it's just like eyes that I have downloaded before I knew you could download like eye colors. I want cute things like little hearts that you can put on your face, like little uh, blush hearts. I'm just trying to make her as cutesy as possible, honestly. I just love her. I don't think she needs a necklace because her collar goes up so high. Yeah, see, the only medical devices they have are hearing aids, which is amazing, but like also, what about the rest of us? 
with medical devices. Next up. I didn't know I had angel wings. <laughs> where did the where are those? As an accessory? Is it a hat? It's a hat. Okay. <laughs> of course it's a hat. This one's kind of nice, but it's not so formal. This is kind of cute. Again, it's not very formal, but like it's the Sims. It's they don't have dress codes very much. Okay, so in my head it's between this one and this one. I'm thinking this one just because I don't, I've never used it. Ooh, maybe the, yeah, those are it. The Monster High ones. From Cupid. I love Monster High. I wish there were more hair accessories options and less hats. Like, when am I going to use this? 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 Never. What? What? I know that's Star Wars. Don't, don't come at me. I'm sure someone wants to use Star Wars in their Sims game, but I never will. I want hair bows, flowers, crowns, headbands. Like what? It doesn't even come in normal colors. These, like this kind of stuff. Things that I've downloaded, not the, not the fairy wings, although they are very cute. Should we give her fairy wings for her formal wear? That's a very magical girl. Yes, we should. Does this, dang it, you can't wear both. I like this mushroom hat, it's very mushroom. But I can't wear the fairy wings and the mushroom hat, unfortunately. This is very cute. <laughs> yes, she's so cute. Oh, and we have to do the makeup for this one. See, this is what I'm saying. Creating a sim takes so long. I don't think that I'm going to do the gameplay in this episode. Yes, this is very cute. I love her so much. The best part about the next few outfits is I don't usually put makeup on them, which is a lot easier since they don't have the button that they had in The Sims, which was like, copy the makeup from each outfit. I like these shorts. The top, not so much. I think in The Sims 3 there was also an option to uh, tuck and untuck shirts. I miss that option. Ooh, I like this. I didn't, I don't think I knew that they were had florals. I really love florals. <laughs> I have always loved florals. I probably will always love florals. Okay, she doesn't need to wear makeup to bed. She does need bunny slippers. It's a necessity. I like this. That's very magical girl, yes, exactly. Perfect, she's beautiful. I like this outfit. It's not at all what we're going for, but it's very cute. I don't usually see randomized outfits that are cute. Very good job, Sims. <laughs> Ooh, she should wear that one fairy outfit for the party. Ooh, these? Mm, those are Operetta from Monster High. Uh, what about these again? They don't match. These? In white? Yes. She is so cute. I know her makeup doesn't have to be like super matchy-matchy to her clothing, but sometimes I just... I... Guys, I really like pink. <laughs> she is so darling. I just love her. Let's not wear makeup while you swim. 
because I don't want it to get in your eyes and get hurt. This is a very cute dress. You know what's perfect? This one that I was talking about earlier. Okay, one more outfit. Let's do her makeup first. Oh, how I wish there was a button to bring the eyeshadow or the makeup from the other outfits to this outfit. I feel like she still kind of looks like all my other Sims. It's probably the pink aesthetic. Hey, <laughs> this is so cute. I love colorful clothing. Oh my god, she's so cute. Look at her. I just love her. Okay, she needs traits and a name. And then we'll give her a house. We won't decorate her house today. But I will give her a house. What do you think her aspiration should be? Magic, duh. Paint. Oh, I almost like yeah. she dislikes paint. Huh. She does not dislike pink. I don't know. Uh, Arbor Hoy! <laughs> well, I'll say she does like pink and purple, and then everything else she can decide on her own. Okay, she is so cute. Okay, I might download someone else to stay in her household, like a roommate or a friend or something, or a sibling. I will be right back. I'm gonna browse the gallery for a magical sim. Okay, this one says it includes no custom content, so we'll see. I would make sims like this. Like, she looks so different than my sim, but all my sims look the same. It's not custom content that's missing, it's things that I don't have from the item packs because I'm not willing to pay exorbitant amounts to EA to get every single one of their expansion packs. Yes, she is very cute. I wish I could make Sims look like this. Oh, it makes me want to watch like a Hallmark Christmas movie. Ah, ah, oh. I don't uh -huh. really like any of the walks. Is this? Hmm. Ah. Hmm. Maybe she can walk like this. It's so. It's kind of cute. Thanks. Uh. She can have this. I like that. That's my favorite. Okay. I think they're ready. I hope so. That's cute. There's like nowhere to there's one place they can live. I think it probably has one bedroom. It doesn't say. Okay. I changed the colors a little bit because again we're going for pink and cute and magical. Pastels. Bright colors. Oh, we'll edit it more in the next episode, but for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye! <laughs>